we're preparing for the worst, but we're praying for the best. You know, we all want an outcome a lot like what we had with Lily. We, we want to have these boards put up for no reason, but sometimes you have to prepare ahead. And, um, and that's what Franklin's used to doing because we, we love living here. Preparation is key and people in Franklin have already started preparing for Hurricane Delta. Franklin Mayor Eugene Folkhart filed a state of emergency paperwork today, days before the storm is even expected to make landfall. Businesses in Franklin are already preparing as well. As Katie Easter reports, business owners say it's never too early to start. Several businesses along Main Street are already boarded up and business owners telling me by the end of the week, every window will be covered. But everybody up and down this town always boards up and there's very few that you won't see plywood on when there's a cat three, four or five coming. Glenn Todd, owner of Todd Photo Creations, hired help to board his building's windows Tuesday morning. And, and if you're not prepared for a windstorm, which boards do, you know, just a little piece of gravel picked up off the ground at 150 miles an hour is going to crack a window. Todd says his early preparations come 30 years after he stayed during Hurricane Andrew. It also shook the, everything in the house, so it just was kind of like making a vibration around the house that was, was unending. It was just an, it, it wasn't like a wind that comes and goes. Across the street, more business owners prepare their buildings, something Mayor Eugene Folkard says everyone should start doing. You just never know which way that storm may turn. We might wake up in the morning and they may tell us that it's going, it's jogged a little farther west. So we just never know. We just have to be prepared and just remain vigilant. On this one, you don't really have any idea that it's that we're going to be on the good side of this storm. No matter where you are on this kind of compact storm, it's going to be bad. Todd says his next step will be sandbagging, and according to the mayor, two locations will be opening Wednesday morning, one on Eastwood Drive and another on Barrow Street. He also said the floodgates will be closing on Thursday. In Franklin, Katie Easter, KTC TV3.